to DIY Damn It, the show where I make crafts you see online so you don't have to. Today in the never ending struggle that is DIY, we are making a homemade dinosaur planter. Watch out Urban Outfitters, I've got spray paint and a dream. With me today is my sidekick Jones. Yeah, his hat makes no sense, I get it, but it was the oldest tiny hat I could find. What goes better together than gardening and toys? Besides gardening toys? Uh, not that much. Today we're taking an everyday object and turning it into a planter so you can impress your friends and paleontologists alike. I mean you, Ross Geller. So when you see a craft project online, you probably think, can I do this? And I'm thinking, can I do this? And you're thinking like, can you do this? You're the one on the camera. <laughs> it's true. So I'm gonna try to actually do this today. Some primer, an awesome color of spray paint, an exacto knife, dirt, teeny tiny succulents, and some rubber toy dinosaurs. But I don't wanna die to be a planner. The hardest part about this project is finding a dinosaur that works as a planner. Found these at Walmart in the dollar bin. So you're gonna grab your exacto knife and this is where it gets a little sad. We're cutting a hole in the back of this guy's back. That's where the plant goes. Two things I'm good at, cutting myself and killing plants. So this should be a fun project. Seriously though, be careful. Watch out for your little fingers. And make a little incision here. It is about an inch and a half across and we're gonna cut down and around. If you want the knife to face away from you. Now we've got an opening. It smells like toxic rubber, so that's probably good. <laughs> Next we're gonna cut holes in his tum tum slash genital area, which I feel terrible about, but be very careful about this. I would suggest not putting your fingers underneath the dinosaur. When you water your plant, you need the water to escape so your plant doesn't die out on you, since you guys already did die out on us. Now we have to prime and paint your dinosaur, and that's probably where they died, paint fumes. All right, and then just let it dry. Maybe an hour, maybe two, maybe a day. Oh good, it's dry, let's paint it. Hold your breath, little buddy. Okay, and now we let it dry. Look at my bro here, and his brand new coat of color. Kept my gloves on, cause we're about to get dirty. So I'm putting dirt in the dinosaur because that's how science works. Now that you've got your dirt in, it's time to put your plant in. I got some succulents, I don't know where you live, but if you have succulents or very small plants or flowers, you should get those. When they grow too big for the dinosaur, that won't be your problem. We're giving these away to everybody we know, quickly, except for this one. What you wanna do with these guys is kind of take them out of their little planter, kind of massage them a little bit. Yeah, I feel creepy but it's necessary. Okay, we're gonna take the succulent and shove it into the dinosaur. Be very careful if you do have a, actually have a succulent. They're very fragile. You've got a dino planter. How cute is that? I'm the cutest dinosaur here. I know you're not the cutest dinosaur I am. The best part about these things is you can give them to all your friends. That's why I invited my friend Grace Helbig over. You guys, it's Grace Helbig! Hi! Hi! Thank you for having me, Jocelyn. I'm so excited. These look great. So take anyone you want. Oh my god, they all look awesome. I think I'm gonna have to go with this guy. He is adorable. I love the copper. Are you sure you want him? But yeah, yeah, he's adorable. He he's kind like... of like ugly and stuff, and he's probably stupid too. Well, do you... I... Do you want him? Just okay, here, but why? Here, here, here. How about this? Game on! We're gonna reenact Les Mis! There's Javert and I'm Cosette! Thanks, Joseph! Thanks, Grace! Thanks, you guys! This has been DIY Damn It! I'm Jocelyn Hughes! Thanks so much for watching, guys! Don't forget to subscribe and come back every Monday for a new video. If you want to see me attempt to make a pillow out of a Boy Scout shirt, click here. And come back next week to watch me make a vase out of a light bulb with Miss Hannah Hart over here. See you guys later.